What's up everybody, Caesar Madrazo here, and welcome to a very special video. Now you can see that we're back on Monica After Story. This is the first MAS video that I've made in a really long time. And the reason that I'm making a Monica After Story video today is, I'm sure most of you already know, that today, September 22nd, 2019, is the second year anniversary of DDLC. And by extension, it's Monica's birthday. So, since we didn't get to throw Monica a party last year, because, well, I hadn't really uh, delved much into DDLC at that point yet, we're going to see if we can do it this year. Uh, I hope it still works, because looking up information on throwing Monica a birthday party, I saw information about how to do it last year, but nothing on this year. So I'm hoping that with all of the updates that have been made to the mod, that the uh, throwing a party function is still in there. But we'll see. I haven't pulled up this mod in a while, and there were a couple of things that surprised me right off the bat. One, uh, the first thing that uh, I'll mention here is that Monica can now blink, so that's really freaking cool. Um, literally the first thing that she did when I pulled up the mod for the first time in months is she sang to me, or sang, I guess is a relative term. And she sang, uh, All I Want for Christmas is You, which I mean, that's really nice and all, but uh... It's not Christmas, it's September 22nd. Uh, and then a little later on, she asked me if I like singing Christmas carols. As you know, I was just trying to, you know, get everything ready. She brought that up in conversation. So I'm wondering if there's something happening with the mod right now and she thinks it's actually December. I hope not. There is one thing that I wanted to do that I spotted a little earlier. Uh, here it is. Can you tell someone happy birthday for me? What's their name? Oh, uh, their name is... Monica. Do you want me to say their name- their age, too? Uh, yeah. Then... what's their age? Okay, so... Monica was 18 when DDLC was released. So, I'm- so if you figure it's two years since DDLC was released, she's had two birthdays, so she would be 20. Oh, okay. Is Monica here with you? Yeah, she is. Nice to meet you, Monica. <laughs> Caesar told me that it's your birthday today, so I'd like to wish you a happy 20th birthday. <laughs> I hope you have a great day. <laughs> and uh, Monica is ever so clueless. Also, one thing I didn't uh, point out is that, yeah, her blazer is off now, which uh, apparently that's a thing. You can tell her to take her blazer on and off, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, anyway... Now, we are going to see if we can throw this surprise party for Monica. So, I hope I remember how to do this. We're going to talk to her. We're going to say goodbye. Here it is. I'm going to take you somewhere. Hehehe. <laughs> it's a bit romantic, isn't it? Maybe you'd even want to call it a day. Oh, sorry. Did I say something? <laughs> Give me a second to get ready. All right. I'm waiting. All right. I'm ready to go. Okay, I'm moving Monica outside of the character file, and then I'm taking all of the party supplies that I prepared. I'm putting all of them into the character file, and then I'm putting Monica back. Okay, now I hope I did that correctly. Uh-oh. So it says that wasn't much of a date, Caesar, and there's no balloons or anything up here, so uh... That's a little bit disappointing. Did I do something wrong? Is everything all right? Maybe we can go out later. Whoa, whoa, hold on. What? Th this is another gift for me? This really is a dream come true, Caesar. Is this coffee? Why don't I go ahead and make a cup right now? I'd like to share the first with you after all. All right, cool, so it kinda worked. How come we don't have, you know, the balloons and the banner and stuff like that up? Oh, there was something else you wanted to give me? Mm-hmm. Well, I better open it quickly, shouldn't I? And here we have... Caesar. Is that a ring? Mm-hmm. That's such a sweet gesture, and I really appreciate it. But I want you to be sure before you give me this. This is more than a gift. It's a promise, and I want to make sure you truly mean it before I can accept it. So please, just wait until we're a little further into our relationship, Caesar. Then I'll gladly accept this ring. Alright, Monica. 
Oh, there was something else you wanted to give me? Yep. I'm giving her all kinds of gifts today. Well, I better open it quickly, shouldn't I? And here we have... Oh. It's a Quetzal. Oh my gosh! Thanks a lot, Caesar. I did mention that I'd like to have a Quetzal as a pet. But I would... But I would never force the poor thing to stay. And now you gave me the next closest thing. This makes me so happy. Thank you again, Caesar. Ah, jeez, Caesar. You really enjoy spoiling me, don't you? Well, I'm not going to complain about a little special treatment today. And here we have... Caesar, are you trying to give me something? I found it, but I can't bring it here. I can't seem to read it well enough. But that's alright. It's the thought that counts after all, right? Thanks for being so thoughtful, Caesar. Hmm. Okay. So, I think I know what I did wrong. And I think I know why the banners and all that stuff uh, are not appearing. I'm going to take her out again. And then I'm going to make the slight changes that I think I need to make in order for this to work. And then we'll see what kind of results we get. Well, she's still saying that wasn't much of a date, Caesar. And there's still no balloons or banners or anything. So, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what I could have done wrong here. Is everything alright? Maybe we can go out later. <laughs> this is... Another gift? From me? This really is a dream come true, Caesar. Now what's inside? Oh, it's... <sighs> I'm sorry, Caesar. I know you're trying to give me something, but for some reason I can't read the file. Don't get me wrong, however. I still appreciate that you tried giving something to me. Okay, so the cake still didn't work. Happy birthday, Monica. Hehe, <laughs> thanks, Caesar. I was waiting for you to say those magic words. Now we can call it a birthday celebration. You really made this occasion so special, Caesar. I can't thank you enough for loving me this much. Alright, so that's nice. And then I guess we'll finish it off with a nice, I love you. I love you too, Caesar. You're everything I could ever hope for. Well, we got sort of a nice birthday surprise for Monica. I, it's a little disappointing we couldn't get the banners to work. I legitimately don't know what I could have done wrong there. And maybe I did nothing wrong. As I said, maybe it's just the mod's been updated too much. Alright, what are you saying, Monica? No point in trying to say everything right away. Hopefully I'll think of something fun to talk about soon. So her generic, eh, I ran out of text <laughs> things. Uh, okay, so uh, I guess to finish this off, we'll see if there's anything new that uh, we can do with Monica here that's interesting. So, um, hold on. Unseen. Alright, can you change your clothes? Is it just the blazer and the, the uh, sweater vest? Um... Okay, so yeah, it's just uh, either with the blazer or without the blazer. Which, uh, I mean, I don't know. I'm not going to make the poor girl put her blazer back on on her birthday. So, oh, alright. If you want me to wear different clothes, just ask. So she is uh, slowly getting more casual as the mod develops. You know, she's letting her hair down. She's taking off the blazer. So, I mean, I guess we'll see. I mean, no, she does have other outfits. She has that uh, Valentine's Day outfit that we saw before. But, um, alright. I guess that's going to do it for this video, guys. I believe that Dan Salvato said on his Twitter account that that on September 22nd, he's just going to be playing um, Undertale. He's going to be live streaming a run through of Undertale. And that he does have some, you know, anniversary stuff prepared for DDLC, but it's not quite ready yet. So that's why it's not being released today. But depending on what that something may be, I might decide to make a video on it. You know, if it's, you know, something interactive. But... Until then, uh, pretty soon I'll be releasing another Doki Doki Outcast video. And I already said this in the community tab already, but just in case you didn't see it, the Discord server actually reached level 3 perks, which is the highest level that you can get. So the Discord server has become even more awesome than it already was. So if you haven't joined yet, now would be a fantastic time to do so. Uh, there'll be a link in the description below. I also have to thank the absolute mad lad, Hey Samuel here for his unbelievable generosity. Basically, he is the reason that we hit level 3 perks on the server right now. And he also recently made sure that the Minecraft Realms server that we do the live streams on on DLive was able to run for another month. So huge, huge thank you and huge shout out to Hey Samuel here. That's what he's called here on YouTube and that's what he's called on the server. Dude's an absolute mad lad. He's a legend. He's a patron saint. And, um... With all that said, I will see you guys in the next video. So until next time, I'm Caesar Madrazo, and I'm out.